use the ruler to measure. Before watching this video, I advise you to watch the video about the units of length by clicking here. To measure small objects, we use a ruler graduated in centimeter. Notice that in this ruler there are numbers. Between each two numbers, there is the same distance. These distances are called centimeter. So here we have one centimeter, and also here we have one centimeter. To measure, we should start from zero, but sometimes zero is not written, so we start from the edge of the ruler. Now we want to measure the length of this pencil. We line it up, then we start from zero, and we look at the end of the pencil. It reached 10 centimeters, so its length is 10 centimeters. Pay attention, if you didn't start from zero, your measurement will be wrong. How to measure the length of this segment? First of all, you should know that we should start from zero. This is the starting point of each measurement. To know the length of this segment, first we will stick the ruler under the segment, line it up and don't forget to start from zero. Finally, without moving the ruler, all you have to do is to look at the end of the segment and read the number it reached. So here, this segment measures 8 centimeters. How to draw a line or a segment measuring 6 centimeters? To draw this segment, you will need a ruler and a sharp pencil. And you have to keep the ruler lined up. If you only hold it on one side, the ruler will turn up or down. It is then necessary to put your fingers in the middle and spread them so that the ruler will not move. Now, we have to draw our segment by sticking the pencil on it and move forward. To draw a line of 6 cm, we start from 0, and with your pencil, go forward to reach the number 6. And here is our segment of 6 cm, is well drawn. For a segment of 10 cm, we start from 0 and go forward to reach the number 10. Obviously, to get used to use a ruler and draw a segment, you have to do more exercises at home.